नमस्कार गुड मॉर्निंग आशा करता हूँ कि आप सब लोग अच्छे होंगे और सकुशल होंगे जहाँ पर भी होंगे पिछले दो दिन से कोई वीडियो नहीं डाला मैंने कुछ बना नहीं पा रहा था कुछ कंटेंट समझ में नहीं आ रहा था मौसम का फिर से कुछ बदला बदला सा मिजाज है सुबह से बारिश का थोड़ा सा माहौल बना हुआ है थोड़ा सा आज उतनी ह्यूमिडिटी भी नहीं लग रही है मौसम अच्छा रहता है तो अपना भी मिजाज अच्छा रहता है तो मैंने लास्ट कुछ वीडियोस बनाए जिस पे मैंने एनजाइटी डिप्रेशन इनके बारे में बताया कि अगर आप परेशान हैं अगर आपको एनजाइटी की प्रॉब्लम है अगर आपके अंदर नेगेटिव थाट्स हैं गुस्सा है इस तरह की अगर चीज़ें हैं तो आप उसको किस तरीके से कंट्रोल कर सकते हैं उसके बारे में मैंने अपने पिछले कई सारे वीडियोस में आपको बताया है आसन के बारे में बताया है प्राणायाम के बारे में भी बताया है सबसे अच्छी बात है कि आप लोगों ने वो वीडियो देखा उस पर कमेंट किया उसके ऊपर आपने अपना रिएक्शन बताया कि आपको कैसा लगता है बहुत सारे लोगों ने तो यूट्यूब पर डायरेक्टली मैसेज किया और कुछ लोगों ने मुझे पर्सनली मैसेज करके भी बताया कि वो उनका गुस्सा शांत नहीं हो पाता है या जो इफेक्ट है वो उतना प्रोमिनेंट नहीं समझ में आता है उन्हें सुबह सुबह ये कबाड़ी वाला आ जाता है ना बहुत डिस्टरबेंस <laughs> मतलब मैं कुछ बोल रहा हूँ और पीछे से कबाड़ी कबाड़ी <laughs> चलिए दो मिनट बाद शुरू करते हैं सो आई एम गोइंग टू शूट दिस वीडियो इन इंग्लिश बिकॉज देर आर पीपल हु वॉन्ट्स टू नो हु वॉन्ट्स टू अंडरस्टैंड थिंग्स मोर प्रॉपरली एंड बिकॉज देर आर पीपल हु आर वॉचिंग माई वीडियोज आउटसाइड इंडिया टू आई एम लकी and happy at the same time so let's shoot let's start let's begin so why is it that when you are doing yoga or when you are doing pranayam you don't feel that effect you don't feel that calming effect see yoga is something which we do which we practice but only the practice or the or only the asana and the pranayam is not only enough for bringing the calming effect to our body we need lot more and many things to bring that soothing effect that calming effect to our nature now when we talk about nature what is our nature when we talk about nature nature is always surrounding so what is our surrounding what is the nature we take in becomes our nature we have read whatever we eat we become so first of all the most important thing is what we are taking in what we are eating what we are drinking what we are consuming becomes our nature now how to change our nature first of all what we call in yoga the sattvic food need to be consumed or in the other word we can say tamasic products tamasic things should be avoided completely if you want to bring those effect to your body we need to stop consuming toxic things or the tamasic things having a vegetarian diet having a light diet not taking any toxins in our body that is very important for an example we can see a tiger a tiger is more aggressive more powerful more angry than a deer a deer or an antelope is more calming more soothing more quick more responsive the food habit is totally different a tiger is a non vegetarian animal and he will eat the flesh whereas a deer and antelope will have a vegetarian diet he will eat grass he will eat leaves trunks fruits but he will not consume non vegetarian food now you see the change in the nature of both these animals we also need to change our nature by changing the food habit this is one thing which we also not call as change in the food cycle now we come to the lifestyle the first thing comes is early to bed and early to rise try to get up before sunrise that is very important getting up early in the morning has always been told in the sanatan culture in the yogic culture it is always prescribed it is always mentioned get up early in the morning before sunrise now how coming back to our point how do we control our mind simple practice every day will bring control on your mind now a very simple rule and a very simple practice is when you are concentrating now where to concentrate we have to put our brain because our brain our thoughts are not something which if you say that don't think about certain things your brain your mind will start thinking about those things if i say don't think about that movie you will start getting into that movie oh that movie was of that xyz hero or that heroine 
and that was the scene, that was the dialogues and your mind is totally into that movie. But we have to bring our mind within ourselves. Once our mind is focused, there are a lot of things which we can do and we can control a lot many things which are happening inside our body. Coming to the breathing techniques, when we breathe, inhale and exhale as slow as possible. There should be no rush. When you are inhaling, inhale slowly. Let the air go till your lungs. Inhale little bit more till your stomach. Little bit more till your upper chest and shoulders. Fill it completely and then slowly release it out as slow as possible. When you practice this on a regular basis, on a, on a daily basis, then you get that hold on your breathing. So inhale and exhale as slow as possible. That is one thing. Now second thing, when we are inhaling and exhaling, bring your awareness to your breathing process. We should never be unaware of our breathing process. When we are inhaling, there is air going in through our nostrils, to our lungs, till our stomach, till our upper chest and shoulders. So we have to be aware that how these how this air is going in slowly, easily and then we are exhaling it out. Remember there should be no pain, you should not be uncomfortable and being at your own comfort you have to do this. So now when you do your pranayam, now when you do your yoga practice, keep these things in your mind because these things will definitely change your perspective about yoga. These things will change how you are doing yoga and you will see the result very soon. If you have liked this video, don't forget to press the like button. And if you are not subscribed to my channel till now, please do it. See you tomorrow in a new video. Thank you.